prepared for hacks guys what is going on i know i know i know it's been it's been a while for those of you that only watch my youtube um there's been a lot of stuff going on and if you don't follow me on twitter don't don't come to my twitch streams you're probably way out of the loop so uh, my birthday was the 13th that's all well, it was yesterday it's 12 34 a.m while i'm recording this right now but that was my birthday, so I've been, you know, getting ready for my birthday. My mom is my mom's birthday is actually on the fourth as well, so I've been doing a whole bunch of crazy stuff. So I'm sorry that the uploads really just have not been here for you guys. So I really do apologize if you're only able to watch me on YouTube, whether it's time zone, whatever. Um, but I did do a 24-hour stream also um, two days ago, on, well Friday through Saturday. So I, I've just been drained physically, everything. But um, you're probably wondering, why do each of us only have four Pokemon? Well, this is a VGC match, and, uh, you know, Worlds was, or <laughs> Nationals was recent, and uh, somebody on my stream, this was a while ago, wanted to do a VGC match, and I was like, nah, I don't know, and then I was like, oh, okay, let's do it, let's do it, so... Um, don't worry, this isn't going to become like the main content of this channel, ever. Uh, VGC is fun every now and then, but it's not for me. I, I can't stand it most of the time. But uh, just just so you guys know that, we're, we're still going to be a smog on channel. When we're not switching sides here. We will always remain on the dark side. But uh, I'm going to choose my Titar and my Amoongus to lead off with. He's going to choose his Whimsicott and his Salamence. That Papa Shrek, though, man. <laughs> Papa Shrek, but uh, I am of course going to be getting the sand stream up. This is actually a team recommended to me by Mac Plays. Some of you may know him. He's at Mac Plays on Twitter. Definitely go give him a follow. Tell him that I sent you there. Um, this is a, the Japan Japan <laughs> Japan Sand team, um, and it's pretty popular in Japan. Uh, and there's an American version that uses Rotom instead of Azumarill, but. I'm going to go ahead and go for Rage Power. Uh, that is going to put the Taunt on me. However, he did go for Hyper Voice, so that is automatically going to hit both of us regardless. But uh, I am going to be surviving that quite well. I am going to be getting an Ice Punch off here. I am actually Choice Scarf Titar, but uh, apparently I'm not running enough speed because I should have outsped Papa Shrek over there. But um, I don't know. I, I could have done something wrong. Maybe there's a possibility. But uh, <laughs> going to be taking some sandstorm damage on my Amoongus, but that is okay. He's actually going to be switching out into Mr. Washi Washi over here. But uh, of course, I am taunted, so I can only go for Giga Drain here. Uh, Whimsicott's going to go for a Moonblast on my T Tar, but I'm in the sand. I can eat it up quite well. Uh, of course, it's going to be lowering my special attack, but who cares about that? I'm going to be going for Ice Punch, and I actually get super lucky. They don't call me the Hacks God for nothing, people. Yes, I get the crit, and I get the freeze. I got the crit, freeze, man, and I <laughs> giga drained on uh, the Rotom as well. Now, I did not predict the Rotom to come in, but it ended up working out quite well, because not only did I get the freeze, the Rotom, I also got a free giga drain that was super effective to help my Amoongus live a little bit longer. His Citrus Berry is going to trigger here. And then everything on the field, except for Titar, is going to be taking Sandstorm damage. So we do have to sit through all of these animations here. I could have turned them off, but what's what's watching a battle without the animations, right? So I'm going to be hit with another Moonblast here again. Not really too worried about it. My Titar can live at least one more. I'm going to be going for another Ice Punch. However, this time aiming for that Whimsicott because this thing is starting to get on my nerves. And, uh, of course, all I can do with my Amoongus right now is go for Giga Drain. But that is perfectly fine because... It's actually going to be enough to kill that Rotom right then and there and give me a decent amount of HP in return as well. So, we're looking pretty tasty on the field right now. I still have all of my Pokemon. He is uh, one Rotom short now. His Wimska is at about 45% HP. Uh, and his Salamence is also uh, quite low on HP as well. He's going to go out to skip Leg Day, the, the nice Conkeller over here. And uh, I'm actually going to switch my T-Tar out because I don't want to take like a mock punch or something from this. Remember guys, I don't play VGC very often, so for those of you that do play VGC, you're probably like, what the fuck is he doing right now? But uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and switch out into my Aegislash here. Aegislash is allowed in VGC, so for those of you that miss Aegislash in OU, there you go. But he, the Conk Elder didn't even focus my T-Tar. He went, went ahead and went for Ice Punch on my Amoongus. Unfortunately, getting a critical hit. Not sure if I would have lived it regardless. But, um, you know, I, I guess that's hacks back for, for the crit freeze <laughs> on the Rotom earlier. But everything's taking Sandstorm damage. So this, this team works really well for me because I don't really have to take that Sandstorm damage. But I'm going to switch out to my Salamence here. Uh, get the Intimidate off, which is great because that Conkeldur is now at minus one. Uh, Whimsicott doesn't really matter too much. I'm going to be Mega Evolving right here. I am going to be going for Protect because... 
I I don't want for whatever reason, whatever reason, this Conk Elder to be like jolly scarfed. Who knows? It's VGC, man. Who knows? Honestly, who knows? But uh, he's going to go for a taunt on my Aegis Slash here, which is perfectly fine with me. I can still switch my Aegis Slash out to get rid of the taunt if I need to. But thankfully, I did go for the Protect. And uh, I can actually transform here, go for the Flash Cannon, and finish off that annoying, annoying Whimsicott, which is great because, like I said, the thing's annoying and I don't want to be dealing with it. I really just do not. Whimsicott is one of those Pokemon where it's just like, oh, this thing again. It's like talk, It's like going to a car dealership and like, like if, if you guys are old enough to know what it's like to uh, talk to car salesmen, it's it's kind of like that. It's kind of like that. But I'm going to be going for a Hyper Voice here. I get the Shadow Sneak off. I'm able to not only take out the Papa Shrek over there, but I'm able to get that Kong Kelder quite, quite low. He's going to be going for a knockoff on my Aegis Slash. I am going to be losing my Aegis Slash here, but that is perfectly okay. All he has left is uh, this Kong Kelder, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm not mistaken, but uh, all, all I have left is Salamence and Titar. And um, uh, he actually ends up forfeiting here, I believe, if I recall correctly. Yep. I was actually going to go for the BM, for the bad manners, for those of you that don't know what BM is, and go for the assurance on the... Um, on the <laughs> Kong Kelder to try and kill it. Uh, assurance is there, I presume, so that you can hit your Aegis Slash uh, and trigger the weakness policy without taking too much damage on your Aegis Slash. So I assume that's why uh, there is Assurance on T-Dar, but who knows, maybe it's too beat up on little old Kong Kelder when he's at low HP. But uh, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Like I said, I know that things have been kind of weird lately, but things are gonna be back on track. Uh, I promise, I can promise you that things are going to get back to normal where there's at least a video every other day but i'm gonna try and pump them out every day for you guys also gonna be getting a wii u soon so you already know that you're gonna be seeing that splatoon and that smash bros come into this channel baby now i'm not gonna pull a shofu i'm not gonna pull a shofu and this channel is not just gonna be full of uh smash bros and like I know it seems like i'm pulling a shofu right now with vgc and i'm talking about smash bros coming up soon but i promise you i promise you that that will not happen to this channel. It just, it can't. It's not me. It's not who I am. I love Smash Bros. Don't get me wrong, but it's not going to happen. I promise. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like on the video. Definitely helps me out, guys. And uh, we'll see you back again tomorrow with some more. We'll see you back tomorrow with a regular video. Regular, like, OU or, or something. It'll be smog on. But, uh, yeah. I'm out of here. I'm done talking. I've talked uh, way too much already. Hope you guys enjoyed. May the hacks be with you all. Peace out.